Hello guys, welcome back to another video, and today, I'm going to be showing you guys, like, how I get that you would, like, screw up on trying to catch a Pokemon using Poke Snipers. So, you know, you type in the coordinates and everything, and then you would, you know, tap on the Pokemon, start them with Pokeballs. Before you throw the Pokeballs, you have to hit that. Tap teleport, hit the select button, then you want to go for that second one right there, and then you move. Then once you move, it's going to move you to the location that you're supposed to be at, and then you're free to throw a Pokeball without the Pokemon instantly running away. So, yeah, let's see, let's catch this Arcanine. One to pops out but he should not run away now if you did this wrong then it would probably run away if you did it correct then you would not have it run away that's what a lot of my friends mistakes are like jelly belly boy that's his mistake right now just doing that it's a common mistake but, oh my god, this Arcanine's stubborn, I think we're actually, we might have to Ultra Ball him, I don't really want to do that, oh god, that was so crappy, but, one, oh my god, Arcanines are stubborn, okay, but I, get, I bet my first Ultra Ball can definitely take this Arcanine, in the house except for that was a bad one one two three there's the arcanine so the pokemon will be pretty hard to catch because i mean they're really good pokemon that yeah they're just pretty good pokemon all right so i'm just gonna catch i'm gonna try to get like a snorlax or something for you guys like one more good rare pokemon and then I will end the video. Um, so far, I'm looking at, like, Mr. Mime, which I know I just passed. Okay, so Mr. Mime is going to be our ending Pokemon if we can get him right here. Oh, God. Um, get that. Oh, my God, I'm screwing up. Okay, get that coordinates in. Um, wait, what? Where, where'd that go? Okay, get those coordinates in. Now, Mr. Mime is spawning right now, and he's going to be there for four minutes. So, I should have the time. Paste. Cut it down to right there. Okay. Now, paste. Come on. Come on. Paste. Microscope. Zoom in. Get it right there. Okay. Move. And now, there's Mr. Mime on our sightings. And there he is. So, like I was saying, this is one of the most common mistakes. People forget to hit the select and tap on that move. And now, you're free to throw a Pokeball. And now, you guys are wondering, man, why the heck are you throwing a regular Pokeball at a Mr. Mime? Well, it's because... I want to like warm him up so then when I come in for the great ball, it's I'm gonna catch him. No, ultra ball because I don't want to use like 10 ultra balls on no, all my ultra balls on him. One pops out because that was like a sucky throw. Oh god, so I'll probably just ultra ball him now. Spin it, yes, spinning nice ultra ball. A lot of raspberries. Two. Oh, Mr. Mine. You're a sneak. No, he just dodged our last um ultra ball guys. We only have one great ball. We really gotta warm Mr. Mime up right here. Oh god, but you're not gonna warm a Pokemon up doing that, especially when it's a Mr. Mime. Oh my god. Why, are you, why did you have to be so stubborn, Mr. Mime? I hate him. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
too. He breaks out, right? Yeah. Oh, thank God he didn't run away. A lot of Pokemon would run away right there. Oh, my God. Oh, thank God he's back. Don't run away, jerk. Ah, oh, yes. Spinning. Uh, one. Did he break out? I wasn't looking. Yes, he did. Guys, this is this is the problem with Mr. Lime right here. So why no one likes him? Oh my God. It's not him. It's me. I have the worst Pokeball throwing ever. One. Did you break out? Ah, oh, so he is gone because Mr. Mime is just so stubborn. But, yeah, that happens a lot with Mr. Mime. So, that's all for this video, guys. I'll see you guys on the next one.